Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Ergophobia Advert, which is a horror game where you work in advertising. You all the time? You... Uh, what do you do? To... With you all the time. Oh, thank God. I thought it was something else. Oh, no. What is this? I guess I need to get some... Uh... Do they call them slides? Do they put on the projectors? No. Something else, right? Snyball over there. What's going on here? Four, five, seven, triple. Huh. Maybe it means see the eye right here. So stand from this perspective to learn it. So three, seven, five, four. Yeah. Okay, uh, that's... Uh, okay. Hey, open up. Door stuck! Maybe this door open instead. Door stuck too! Maybe a uh, door didn't open. Maybe like a case did. Oh yeah, with you all the time. With you all the time, yeah. What are we actually selling here? Weird. How does this door open? Okay. Do, do we sell log chopping? Is that a thing? So there's a lot of this log chopping mascot. Oh man, someone blew something up in the microwave. What I keep telling you about not microwaving someone's heart. What? What's that? And they're really with me all the time. I don't think there's anything of note in here, right? No, there is. Whoa. Thanks, buddy. With you all the time, yeah. I keep saying that. I, I, I've i already said it once. Were you there before? Maybe. You were definitely there before. I'm not sure if you were there before. It somehow feels like there's more of them. Oh, why well, ain't going that room? <laughs> Not yet. Oh my God, there is a heart. I was making like a joke about the, the stupid. I'm like, like oh, what would what would make it red? I'm like, oh, it's a heart, right? No, you literally microwave a heart. How did I call that? I didn't actually see the heart. That's what you're thinking. It's actually a heart shape too. Okay, you microwave the heart and you get a uh, a thing here. Which makes sense, I mean. I feel like this is an effective marketing campaign.
Huh. Not trust these signs, man. Ain't trusting these things. Okay, I don't have to go back all the long way anymore. Oh my god. Even in the bathroom? No. Damn, that trash can's really empty. Like my soul. Are you changing your direction? I'm not even sure it was like a point of going in there. Okay, that leads there. There's an elevator here. God, it's like a... Mm, maybe not quite a nightmare, maybe more of a dream. You okay? Well, that church is plain empty. This one here? Because your mouth is sewn shut? Papers. Well, I guess you might be going there. We'll just do it like this, and I'll put you here. Yeah, that was right. I guess the empty chair is in case you want to like, put one back down. You know what I mean? So, like, if you put the one on the wrong area, you can, like, have a, uh... What is the file I need? Thank you. Man, I ain't feeling this. Oh, that's getting a little... It's getting a little odd. Now what? Hey, buddies. How you doing? Whoa. Maybe this room is not as bad. Yeah, it's a little better. I kind of like how they seem to... They, they did turn, right? I'm not just seeing things. Yeah, they turn when I... Okay, I see what they're doing. Watch. Something they're everywhere. <laughs> Oh, I see. It makes him disappear. And then we have the file. Cool. Yeah, just cover up all that cruelty. <laughs> ah, I see. Oh, that door is locked. I'm suspecting they're with me all the time. Whoa. What is that thing? I can't...
Huh. I, I, I'm not really sure what that was. So, that's it for Ergophobia Advert. I have played a couple of these games. So far, I believe they've all been sent in offices or some form, and um, they are a little bit similar in that I wouldn't... They kind of make me think of, like, older style indie horror games where it's a little more surreal and not in, like, oh, there's weird Silent Hill monsters kind of surreal kind of way, although I think there was kind of one at the end. But just more like there's, like, a distorted kind of soundtrack. There's, um, you're not really quite sure what you're doing. You're going around finding things and weird things or, like, unsettling things are popping up. And I can't really say if there's, like, a story to this or not. Like, you're welcome to do your own interpretation if you think there is one. Um, I, I'm somewhat personally led to believe maybe it could just be more of a atmospheric story where it's not quite designed to maybe have a... There might be some loose symbolism there, but it, it, it's primarily like this is kind of like an unsettling image. Um, and especially, like, the text, like, with you all the time. But yeah, the whole thing, um, and even the, the, the previous couple of ones I played, uh, strangely nostalgic to me. And it's not like that era of, like, horror games was that long ago. It just gives me a certain, like, feeling. But yeah, anyway. So, thank you all for watching play Ergophobia Advert. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.